Imagine what you read becomes. Today we will review scary stories to tell in the dark. It's a movie and a thrilling horror movie that takes place in the small town of Mill Valley in 1968. The film follows a group of teenagers who stumble upon a haunted book filled with terrifying stories. As they read through the book, the stories start to come to life and the group realizes they are in the grave danger. So the main character Stella Nichols is a bookish and imaginative teenager who along with her friends Augie and Chuck decides to explore an abandoned mansion on Halloween night. Inside the mansion they discover a hidden room where they find a mysterious book belonging to the mansion's former owner Sarah Bellows. The group decides to take the book with them not realizing the horrors that await them. As they start to read the stories strange occurrences begin to happen in their small town. The first story Harold tells the tale of a scarecrow that comes to life and seeks revenge on its owners. The second story the red spot is about a girl who discovers a mysterious red spot on her face that turns out to be something much more terrifying. The group realizes that the stories are coming true and that they are being targeted by the vengeful spirit of Sarah Bellows who has been trapped in the mansion for decades. They must unravel the mystery of Sarah's past and stop her from unleashing her wrath on the entire town. The movie is a terrifying journey filled with jump scares, eerie visuals and a spine-chilling soundtrack that will leave you on the edge of your seat. The cast delivers strong performances, especially Zoe Quality as Stella, who brings a depth of emotion to her role. Overall, Scary Stories to Tell in the Dark is a must-watch for horror fans looking for a chilling and suspenseful experience. The film captures the essence of the original book series while also adding its unique twist to the story. Get ready to be scared out of your wits. Before I end the video, do subscribe to my channel. Have a good time.